Hi everyone, today we'll be talking about blue nails. So what are they? It's a type of nail discoloration where the nails appear bluish or blue. In fact, it's the skin underneath the nails that turns blue and not the actual nail itself. And the medical word for such discoloration is cyanosis. Hence, blue nails are also referred to as cyanotic nails. Let's move on to discuss the possible causes. As a matter of fact, cyanosis or blue skin, including the skin beneath the nails, indicate that there is not enough oxygen in the blood. This implies that cyanotic nails may result from circumstances that lead to poor circulation or lack of oxygen in the blood. And this can be caused by something relatively harmless or physiological, or it could be due to an underlying medical condition, and this is referred to as pathological cyanotic nails. An example of physiological process that may cause nails to turn blue is called temperature. Cold causes blood vessel to narrow and makes it hard for oxygen-rich blood to reach the skin beneath the nails. However, the discoloration is temporary and goes away when you warm up. As for pathological cyanotic nails, the blue or bluish discoloration is a symptom and needs to be investigated to determine the cause. Additionally, it tends to be more permanent. In fact, various disorders are involved. And the first one we can talk about is Raynaud's phenomenon or disease. This is a rare condition in which cold temperature or strong emotion causes blood vessels, usually in the fingers or toes, to narrow or spasm. And this prevents blood from reaching the affected area, making the skin appear white or blue. The difference between renal phenomenon and disease lies in that renal disease is a primary condition. This means it occurs without any triggering illness. Nevertheless, renal phenomenon is a secondary condition. It, this means it occurs as a result of an underlying illness. The next set of possible causes that may result in the nails developing blue tinge includes many diverse length problems such as COPD, an umbrella term for lung diseases that block airflow and make it difficult to breathe, for example, chronic bronchitis, emphysema, a disorder affecting the tiny air sacs of the lungs. Other lung disorders include asthma, acute respiratory distress syndrome, lung infection or pneumonia, blood clot in the lungs, medically known as pulmonary embolism, etc. Also, variety of heart conditions may lead to bluish discoloration of the nails. This includes problems like different heart defects present at birth or congenital, heart failure, and so on. In addition, cyanotic nails could be a side effect of certain medicines or drugs such as azetotimidine, minocycline, sparfloxacin, hydroxyurea, imipramine, gefitinib, and cyclophosphamide. And within this entity, I'd like to draw special attention to what is called colloidal sulfur, which is a suspension of silver particles in a liquid, an ancient all-purpose remedy that was used for various infections and illnesses. Be aware that prolonged use of colloidal sulfur products can cause irreversible blue color not only on the nails but on the entire skin as a result of silver buildup in the body over time, a condition known as orgeria. And this is a picture of the deceased Paul Carson, the famous blue man known as Papa Smurf. He developed Argeria as a result of silver poisoning from dietary supplements he had taken for over a decade after he saw an advertisement in a magazine promising health and rejuvenation through colloidal silver. Furthermore, cyanotic nails could be a reaction to being at high altitude because less oxygen is available for breathing. Moreover, some troubles might affect red blood cells and lead to less oxygen being delivered. This may result in bluish or blue discoloration of the nails. These abnormalities include methemoglobinemia, a blood disorder in which an abnormal amount of methemoglobin is produced. And what is methemoglobin? It's a form of hemoglobin. And hemoglobin is the protein inside the red blood cells that binds oxygen and releases it to cells throughout the body. However, methemoglobin cannot bind oxygen and this leads to not enough oxygen getting into your cells, which causes the nails to appear blue or cyanotic in addition to other symptoms. This condition can be inherited or acquired, that is to say, it's caused by exposure to certain foods, medicines, or chemicals. Next, we have carbon monoxide poisoning. It can cause your nails to change color to blue, along with other signs and symptoms. It's because the carbon monoxide binds hemoglobin and reduces oxygen delivery. 
And finally, we have polycythemia vera, a type of blood cancer in which too many red blood cells are produced. This excess in red blood cell count results in thickening of the blood slowing its flow, which leads to restricted blood circulation that might cause the nails to appear blue. As for treatment, it's based on restoring adequate oxygenation to the blood and optimal blood flow around the body, and this involves figuring out the underlying cause and addressing it. To sum up, blue nails may indicate inadequate amount of oxygen in the blood. There are many possible causes, some of which are serious. If you have blue or bluish discoloration of the nails, it tends to be more permanent or associated with other symptoms. It's best to seek medical attention. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching.